Hey, hi, what's up? So I thought I'd go over my favorite, well, I guess not favorite, but shows I've kind of watched in this video. Um, I don't know why, but I'm going to be rating them from how much I like from one another. Honestly, I don't really know why I'm doing this, but I'm bored, so why not? A is good, E sucks ass. So without further ado, here are my shows I watched, I guess. I don't really, some of them are my favorite, some of them suck dick. So yeah, here we go. All right, first one up, uh, Grey's Anatomy. Uh, I watched the first episode for the show and it sucked ass. E. All right, second runner up, we have Peacemaker. I have genuinely enjoyed the show. I enjoyed what they did with it so far, and I'm curious to see where they're going and where they're going to take this show and which direction they're going to take this show in, basically. Uh, it's a B. Letterkenny. Now, this show is on my watch list. I've put time into watching it, and I kind of regret it just a teensy tiny itty little bit the show wasn't bad around seasons one to three were good honestly but i can't see myself wanting to finish the show i'm gonna put it at a c the golden girls now i know i made a video on how i hate sitcoms but i don't exactly hate the show nor love it it's it's it's, it's from a different time where laugh tracks were everything to hype up a joke but now it's kind of just meant for me. It genuinely can be funny at times, but honestly, the laugh tracks ruin it for me, so I'm going with a D. All right, uh, fourth runner-up, regular show. I've put so much time into watching this show. It's really funny at points, and I have so much nostalgia for this show. I'm going to put an A on this one. I love it so much. This is my one of my favorite shows. Adventure Time. Same thing with regular show. The show just still holds up so well, and... With just how much I love the show, it's going with an A as well. A little biased, but I mean, two of my favorite shows, kind of can't miss them. <laughs> well, Rick and Morty, number six. Uh, I do love this show, but uh, lately it still feels different. Like, the show's taken such a weird turn in the later seasons. Like, seasons one to two and three, I actually enjoyed all three of those. Season three is where everything kind of changed. So it's kind of fallen off for me. I'm going to put it at a B. Still a good show, but needs some improvement with the writing, in my opinion. Maybe they could change it up with season six. I don't know. Number seven, Crossing Swords. I really don't want to talk about this show, but I watched it a little bit. Uh, Seth Green's backing it up, I guess. You know, the guy who made Robot Chicken or the voice of Chris from Family Guy. Show's okay, but not great. I mean, the show can be all over the place at the times, and I mean seriously, it can. Uh, I love the animation style, I guess. It's it's actually really good, but it's, it's kind of all I watched it for, honestly. I'm going to go with a D for this one. Didn't fully hate it, but not my favorite by a long shot. All right, number eight, The Boys. I don't even know where to begin with this show, honestly. It's, um, it's so good, though. It's so fucking good. The storytelling is done just right, and the quality for the show is almost just as good as a high-budget movie. By high-budget, I mean it's way up there. Um... Not going to say much, but just let me recommend this show to you. It's an A for me. I would put it even higher if I could, but yeah. Number nine, Solar Opposites. This show is kind of good. I mean, it's not the best Justin Raylan has to offer, but the real reason I really watch the show is because of the B-plot. I'm not going to spoil much, but there is a second story to where the people in the neighborhood, uh, you know, where the aliens live, get shrunk and have to live in the wall of the alien's house. It's really good, but that's all I really liked about the show, honestly. Um, I'm going to give it a C. All right, last but not least, One Punch Man. I have to say, I don't watch too much anime, but One Punch Man is really good. Uh, great story, and it's funny. It's pretty much as simple as that, that's all I'm going to say. Um, it, it's an anime, so it's got its anime humor in there, I guess. Uh, B tier. I actually like the show a lot. <laughs> Alrighty, so if you enjoyed the video... Uh, leave a like and subscribe if you didn't enjoy it uh, fuck off I guess um, yeah that was pretty much it I was bored and wanted to make a, a video on shows I've watched yeah okay bye